Dark Winter. Hey guys, what's up? Spectre here, and in this video I wanted to review one of my absolute favorite weapons, the high-end Vector 45 ACP. First I'll be showing you guys the base version I crafted, and then I'll add my usual attachments. To start off, here are the base stats. 8,966 damage with 750 rounds per minute. But what has to be the Achilles heel of this weapon is the tiny magazine, which only holds 20 bullets to a mag. You'll be doing more reloading than firing, but with the right mods you can fix that problem. Scrolling down to the talents, we see Brutal, headshot damage is increased by 24%, which definitely comes in handy on such an accurate weapon. The next is Dominant, every kill performed while your signature skill is active reduces the cooldown of your other skills by 8%. And finally, Commanding, every kill performed while the signature skill is active extends its duration by 18.50%. So these talents play together nicely, again this is without any attachments. Here's the recoil, I won't fight it, I'm just holding down the right trigger. There isn't much of a jump, but then again, with such a small mag, there wouldn't be. This gun also tends to jump from side to side horizontally rather than vertically. With the right attachments, you can mitigate that though. Here, I'll fire on the long range target again, this time fighting the recoil, and again with the short range target. Now I'll be fighting the recoil, keeping the gun as stable as I can at multiple ranges. You can see it does have a small issue with horizontal jumping from recoil, but overall it's a pretty stable weapon. Jumping into some mods now, I pair the weapon with this high-end scope I crafted, usually meant for sniper rifles, but it gives my vector a nice DPS buff, and a nice 22.50% buff to headshot damage. This is just another way my vector build really rewards accurate play. This high-end scope I crafted helps fix the small clip issue, bringing my mag size up to a more respectable 39 rounds. It also buffs my critical hit damage by 31%. Next is the PEQ laser, which buffs my accuracy by 18.50% and the hipfire accuracy by 26.50%, making this weapon even more deadly accurate. And finally, the muzzle, which helps bump my accuracy further along with a higher crit chance. And we'll just make it pretty here. Here's another long range shot without fighting the recoil. You'll notice a greater vertical jump from the recoil, but that's due to the larger mag size. And this is short range fire without fighting the recoil. And now I'll try to steady it at both ranges. And here's some mid-range fire for good measure. Overall, I really enjoy the Vector. My build in particular really rewards accurate play, with different buffs and talents hinging on crit shots. This weapon is deadly accurate and doesn't have too much recoil. I would definitely recommend having this one in your arsenal. However, if you're more the type who likes a large mag and a powerful punch, I'd stay tuned for my upcoming review of the Black Market AK-74. Remember to sub for more Division content, and as always, thanks for watching, guys.